This is the city. The city of Absalom. The city at the center of the world. Absalom is celebrating the Radiant Festival, a three-month festival of epic proportions held once every hundred years. The celebration attracts all types. Tourists, performers, merchants, inventors, as well as unsavory types, petty thieves, gangs, cults, and criminal enterprises. That's where we come in. We protect and serve. We are the agents of Edgewatch. Hey everyone, welcome to Roll for Combat, Agents of Edgewatch. I'm your GM and host, Stephen Glicker, and in this week's episode, enough talk. It's time for combat, and the agents have been ambushed. How are they going to handle it? Let's find out. So this part of the adventure is a little odd, because they were put into a fortress, and they're supposed to defend this fortress. However, the fortress is full of of holes and windows and doors and it is a total mess it's it is not very defendable which is a little strange i don't know i would have probably made this a little different or at least made a couple of very specific weak points the problem with making a place so undefendable is you get what these guys did which is they couldn't figure out how to defend it and where to put up the defenses, so they kind of just said forget it and just let the bad guys in and that's it. Which isn't a bad, you know, idea in general. But as someone who plays Dwarf Fortress and Rim World, if you never played those games, is that you're often attacked quite a bit. And you set up these kill box lanes because the way those games work is that if you don't give a area for the bad guys to go in, they will find other areas and break into your fortress. So what you do is you create these very elaborate long kill boxes. They're like serpentine snakes and you put like turrets all around them. So the bad guys see an opening. They're like, oh, look, it's wide open. And then they go through this atrociously horrible place. And these guys actually did that. They made it very inviting for the bad guys to go into the center of the fort, which is where you in theory would put flak fatter because there's a cage in there and it's well defended and it's it's just a very well made position for defense the problem is they couldn't figure out how to disable the traps so they're like hey let's just make it that people go in there and they get killed by the trap so that's actually not a bad idea they kind of did it so we'll see how that goes. And me being the GM, I'm going to play the NPCs as, you know, idiots. And if they see that, they're going to be like, oh, cool, let's go in there. And they will, you know, they're going to do that. So I'm not going to be like, oh, I'm not going to fall for it. You know, I'm going to have them each do their thing. But there's a lot of waves coming. This is just the very beginning. This is going to be a long 72 hours. And that's what I'm going to say is that this is, this is going to take a while. This is kind of a strange adventure because it's pretty short. It's only three chapters, but there's so much that happens in each of these chapters. And there's so much combat that it's actually taken us quite a while. I think some of the other adventures we were done by now, but we're like not even halfway through this one. So... I'm having a lot of fun, and actually, you're going to start seeing some pretty crazy shenanigans in the next couple of episodes. It just, it just gets wild. In other news, we have released a ton of things. If you want to get Battlezoo Ancestry Dragons for Roll20, it's out now. It's out for both Pathfinder and 5e. The Jewel of the Indigo Isles book is out for 5e and Pathfinder, at least the first adventure. And the Indigo Isles character guide for Pathfinder is out now as well. So there's a lot going on. There's a lot out. Just go to battlezoo.com and you can download and get all this right now. This is all from the very first Kickstarter. We are very close to finishing up everything. Again, it's one of those good news, bad news situations. I'm looking here and let's see. We put out 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 books in one year. So... That's a lot of books, okay? Now, some of these are small, like the Eldamon Guide. You know, it's not a very, very large book. But, you know, Battles of Ancestry Dungeons, I'm counting that because that took time and effort, and we've been updating it, so that counts as a book. So that's a lot of books to put out in a single year for basically a two-man operation. It's just me and Mark, and that's it. I mean, we've got a million freelancers who help us, but we're the only full-time people here, so... That's a lot of books, and we still have another one or two coming out this year. So, yeah, that's a lot. 
Next year is going to be a lot more calm. We're putting out less books. Although we're putting out more... Actually, that's not true. We're putting out more books in the terms of ancestries. And there's going to be 13 ancestries and guides coming out. Times two, so that's 26. So, okay. That's a lot of books. Okay, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe we're going to be coming out with like something like 30 books next year. But a lot of them are very small books. Because they're only going to be single ancestry. Also, those of you wondering, how on earth did we make ancestries slash races large for 5e? Let me tell you, I'm doing the ancestry slash races for the Indigo Isles character guide, and you won't believe it, but the 5e races are larger than the 10-page ancestries for Pathfinder. That's right, 10-page ancestries, 12 to 14-page races. So if you're curious, you get it now at BattleZoo.com, the Indigo Isles character guide, and it's got a lot of cool stuff in there. Check that out, and then also don't forget Year of Monsters next year. We're going to have tons of cool monsters that you can play. Get that at BattleZoo.com. Anyhow, with that, let's get to this week's exciting episode. Well, this is the thing. When you come out, you're realizing Lomang, you were slowly getting sucked into the mirror dimension. Mm. And if you didn't come out, you would have been stuck there forever oh my god that's a <laughs> horrific fate however out of the mirror in front of gomez a strange creature steps as if it was just walking out of the corridor this large creature looks at you and can they talk no they have no language it has a mouth no he's small it's this small little fake creature and he just sort of looks at low at Gomez. He just goes, Ah, intruder! Out of my house. So first, he steps out of the mirror. Second, he is going to hit you with his hand. Mirror oh. hand! Oh, no. Eek. He slashes you. <laughs> you as in Gomez? Gomez, yes. yes. He literally slashes him. Like his, he's made out of glass and mirrors, and he like cuts you. Ow. I know. How, how much is that? What is that, 17? 17 times 2. 17 Ooh. times 2? Yeah, he critted you. Ooh. So it's what, 34? 34, and you are bleeding badly. It's actually going to be a ton of bleed damage when that comes. And that was the first attack. And then he's going to cut the doggy for his second attack. Mirror hand. Oh, he misses. Lomang, you're up. <laughs> you just saw that. All right. Picture of this guy. So I assume all of my stuff is off, right? With stances and all Everything's that. Everything's off now. Yeah, yeah. Starting fresh. Okay, so right. There, that's what that guy Shatterling, like, I will hit you with blunt damage and break you. Okay. Move there. Yes. That is a move, and then I will do... He just killed him. I have one action left. Mm -hmm. It's so nice having the stance for free. I like it. All right, here we go. Flurry! Plus flanking, oh, because the roll? Gomez is never unarmed. That is a terrible... You rolled a 29! <laughs> Dude, yeah, that was a miss. Okay. Oh, I would that, maybe. That is a... 35. That's a miss. The mirrors are confusing you. He is made of mirrors. You're like, ah, I can't see. I can't see him properly, and I'm out of action. You are oh. out. Dougie, there's a mirror man near you. All right. Okay. Kiki, stop. I have a feeling, I have a feeling if you if you delay your turn, that Gomez will leave that space. I am going to delay my turn. Well, yeah, till after Gomez. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Gomez, you're up. You're bleeding profusely. The mirror hand cut you bad. It, it, it's correct. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't prefer to be here. I think I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna run like a. I'm, I'm gonna run behind mommy and daddy over here. I'm gonna hide. Are you moving? Okay. I am mo I'm moving. I'm you moving. know what that means. Attack of uh, opportunity. <laughs> I hate these things. He cuts you. Oh, he hits you. That's actually a good yeah. thing. Then he won't hit Dougie. 20 points of damage as he cuts you as you run away. Cut, cut, cut. With an attack of opportunity. And I will use that scroll of fissile heal on myself. Did you have it out? Yeah, yes, I did. still had it out from last time. I thought you used it. No. No, this is uh, he. his last no, action is, uh, was to get out another yeah, scroll. Yeah, 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 got it. Yeah, I'll use that one up. Okay, you use that up. Great. 
Well, that's just 19 if you're using it for one. Oh, no, you're doing two actions. So. Yeah, yeah, two action heal. So 59. That's pretty good. Except it's all going to go away, because guess what? Bleed, diamond. 16 points of bleed. Oh, my God. Yep. That's what happens, baby. Does he have to roll a thing, though? Uh, yeah, what? well, yeah, you're you're you overhealed. Oh, the, the healing makes the bleed go away? or, or no. no, no, that's not how it works. Sort of. Well, actually, wait. Isn't there like a flat check or something? It is. Oh, wait, there is one way to get rid of bleed, which never happens, so I actually want to check that real quick. Bleed. Medicine check. Persistent, weakness, physical. Bleeding damage ends automatically if you are healed to full hit points. Guess what? Oh, yay. That has never ever ever happened nice. until now <laughs> it's the first time ever thank you there we go. thank you paizo <laughs> thank you i remembered that obscure yeah. rule that is so, good because it never comes up because it never ha you never go to full you're always like yeah, one yeah. away but you heal you overhealed and you got rid of your heal. you got it you, you did it got rid of the bleed good job Gomez. problem solved that never happened dougie you're up it's like you weren't even hit. You're like, it's like yep. nothing happened. Yep. Except you're right next to the evil mirror, and we might have evil Gomez, and he's going to start casting harm on everybody. Oh, my God. Uh, All that'll right. be fun. Dougie is not afraid to move around this creature. Wow, you so taunt you it while you that? move? Like, you blah, see blah, that? Blah, blah, blah. Yep. Um, you see that? Is... You see that? Here we go. Devil slice. Attack of opportunity. <laughs> it uses, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that would be funny if you had another one. That would be uh, funny. Rapier. With the, my devil slice. Dougie's just like, oh, it's a crit. Oh. It's That's a your crit. third crit in a row. It's what insane. Is it is, on? actually. Uh, well, it's when I hit. I've missed, though, between. It's not fair that I keep missing, too. Okay. Damn. Well, this is 22, 44 plus 7 is 51, and it is uh, in What type of damage, though? Piercing. Piercing. Okay, you smash it pieces of it and falls them to the ground. And he's like, ah! It's the most horrific sound ever. And he looks at you and he says, You have 14 years bad luck now! <laughs> <laughs> Does he not take that damage? No, he took the damage. Oh, okay, okay. all right. I'm just uh, being, he's I'm talking just being like he's melodramatic. Not any. Okay. No, he took it. Boy, all those rolls were good. Okay, so he's enfeebled. And I am going to attack him with a shark sword. Oh, that's a uh, thirty-one. Thirty-one. Did I miss? Yeah. All right. Now he's going to uh, attack him with the short sword again. Thirty-three. Yep, Basil. I'm going to go ahead and move into melee range. I I feel like glass ought to be susceptible to bludgeon so i'm gonna put my sheath back on my sword cane and since i only have one action left i'm gonna attack without my stratagem still a pretty good attack and you hit so it'd be nine bludgeoning nine bludgeoning does a lot of extra damage as you smash and you see large chunks of him coming off instead of small chunks that was that was just a guess but okay you did 24 points of damage all right, I guess I will shout. If you can bash it, that helps. I'm going to react to your hit and attack. I am not going to bash it because I have short swords. So that's, I assume, it, I I assume it takes actions to use for shifting rune. Yeah, yeah, that's it's a whole thing. I should have shifted before, but I have to attack. Yeah. Oh, a forty-two! Ding, ding, a ding, ding, ding. Not a, not a crit. Yeah, it's only 13, though. Sneak attack. He's flat-footed. Yeah, he's flat-footed. He's fl flanked. He's flanked. Yeah. He's oh, that's so right. 19. Oh, I'm thinking because Basil's not. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, 21. Done. So, Basil, go ahead. Is everyone done? Me. Well, no, I was done anyway, so. The Shatling. He sees you all around him. He steps into the mirror. Boo. He reappears here. And then he throws mirror darts. And Gomez. Hey, Gomez. Ah. Uh. Mirror darts. 40 hits you. 28 points of damage. Shink a shink. He hits you with all those darts. Ow. And then he throws more mirror darts at you. Ugh. Oh, he misses. Good. Oh, that's the wrong button. He's done. Mm. 
There goes our flanking. <laughs> That's right. He just ran right through the mirror like it was nothing. Oh, I use my mobility so he can't attack of opportunity me. Okay. Hold on. Is Are you sure you want to go there? Nope, I'm not sure about that. Actually, hold on. Is this There's a wall over here. Right? Oh, I can't see there. to that side. I don't know what's going on. There's a wall. Yeah, yeah. there's a wall. There's a, this is the only place. It's here, here, or here, so I'll give you the top two. All right, that's one action. Second action, attack, attack, attack. Actually, uh, second action, I'll, I'll do my key. Focus my key and do key strike. Here we go. Oof. That is a hit. Uh, this is bludgeoning. It is. Is the fire, electricity, sonic, any of that? It immunity? all counts. I don't know how a mirror takes a fire and sonic electricity, but it does. 46 damage. Okay. Well, you actually do... Plus bludgeoning, yes. Uh, 61. Nice. Oosh, crash. Large uh, pieces. Here we go, again. I'm off. Oh, you hit him again. 14, 37, 39 damage. Plus whatever uh, extra. Really? That's 54. Wow, that's a nice attack. Yeah, it was about 100 points in one. Gomez, you're up. You got more what mirrors in you. You got go mirror on. shards in you. <laughs> Gomez, go around him and give me flanking. <laughs> no. You can't. There's a wall. Uh, oh, okay. You know what? I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i hit him with an electric arc to see what happens. It's going to bounce off and hit me. <sighs> Interesting. Okay. So you're trying to hit him with electricity? I am. Okay. Two things are going to happen. First, he's going to reflex. See if he gets out of the way. Uh, what is that? That is a reflex. 41. Uh, he is... He takes it, and he reflexes and redirects the electricity damage that was supposed to get hit him, and it gets redirected to a mirror right here, and the mirror gets smashed, and he takes no damage. All right. Wow, that's interesting. Now that's is that mirrors. a good thing or a bad thing? It seems like uh, I don't, we don't want these mirrors here. Yeah, I, I like that. It's mixed. Actually. It keeps him in the fight, but on the other hand, it removes his avenues of change. Mm. Like, oh, and he took no damage. Yeah, yeah. And he took no damage. And it's like, considering those mirrors were unbreakable without that, I like using him to break those mirrors, to be honest. Yeah. But anyway, I, I'm for my last action, I, I I don't like him. I don't like him. I don't like getting cut. I'm leaving. I'm You're leaving again. Yeah, <laughs> You're leaving. hiding. I'm hiding. <laughs> yeah. There's a mirror right there. All right. Yeah, without uh, without the nicks and cuts it. of a blade. I'm not touching it and not looking at it. I'll be careful. Mad Eye is up. All right. I'm going to shift my sh uh, short sword into a mace. There it is. Ding, 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 ding. And move and attack twice. Rapier. Oh, you hit. Four, eleven. And, sh well, we'll call it short sword, but. Oh no. no. Oh gosh. Why did I miss that? That's a shame. That is a shame. Critical miss. You're done. Done. Basil. Yes, I'm going to move here and I'm going to devise a stratagem. Ew, that sucks. Roll the two. And unfortunately, I don't have two actions to even cast a full spell. Shoot. I just, I'm just going to go ahead and cast shield. Ride it out for a round. Sorry, guys. It's all right. I think we got this. Mm -hmm. Hopefully. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. He steps into that mirror whoop, and steps out of this mirror and is right next to Gomez again. Hi, I'm gonna, Gomez. I'm going to use my reactive. Oh, he really <laughs> likes so Gomez, much. doesn't he? I'm, I'm using my reactive pursuit to follow him. You can't. You, you try and you go right through the mirror. You, can, you, you bump into the mirror. You bump into the mirror. Well, wait. I, does he. He goes into the mirror. You can't follow yeah, the mirror. I suspect it's because it's, it's, it's like it's, an interdimensional it's, travel. It's oh, basically like it. a tele. Right. Yeah. It's yeah. called it's mirror jump. He literally jumps through mirrors. Oh, that's annoying. So you can't follow him. Hey, Gomez. Uh. Mirror hand. Duh. Oh, no. Wow. Yeah, like Good. Mirror hand. Oh, no. It's actually Good. worse. Good. Whoops. How does he continuously miss you? I'm, so, I'm happy. You're some is. lowly goblin. Lomang's up. <laughs> All right. Lomang, uh, wait, wait until I take my turn, because then I can get an extra attack when you move. Oh, you mean when I attack? Yeah, yeah. Because you're never when you go in front of me, 
then I'm not next to you, and you don't get uh, your action. All right, uh, yeah. I, I will delay. So Gomez is next. You know what? I'm even going to give you. F- no, I'm not going to do that. Gomez is up. Gomez is this, up. Oh, this Gomez thing, is up. Oh, I'm sorry. This thing really annoys me. I'm tempted to just like burn a slot to try and kill him. Don't do that. Gomez guy's, has the bloodlust. This, this guy's on his last yeah. shard. I don't like getting hit. I don't. No. I don't like it. And I don't, I don't like I don't attacks like, opportunity well, either. He's not yeah, going to survive to his next turn. That's a bold claim. You don't never, never know that. We're gonna we're gonna rough him. Oh, I know what I'll do. I will delay until after you guys kill him. How about that? The, the, yeah. Until right, Basil so takes I delay his until, turn. I, I delay until after Basil even. Bad cleanup if he's still up. Oh wow! You went all the way to the bottom. Okay, now Lomang's up. Or so do I have to go now? Or Dougie no, no, go? no! You can delay again. Now yeah. Dougie's up. Okay, <laughs> let's uh, just figure this out. Okay, so rapier. Somehow my shifting ru- ru- rune is not on my weapon anymore. Where's my blanking? I think I need to. Uh, you might have to get from uh, Gomez. Um, Why did you not? Take I, I will have below. Fight. Yeah, I oh, don't want to take should, extra yeah, hits. Whatever. I don't you want to. You wouldn't take extra hits if you, if you moved here. Oh. That's here. true. Okay, yeah, I'll just move there. Okay, that's right. Because I, I don't take attack from opportunity. That's right. Okay, that's a good thing. We're communicating. This is good. All right, so I'm going to move and attack. Is, the, is this like, that teamwork I've heard so much? Yeah, teamwork. it's like other groups do this. I forget the name of what it's called. You guys had good teamwork when you killed Lomang. Okay, that's a 43. What type of There's a lot of pent-up anger. Piercing. Here's what happens. Yeah. We had a system for killing Lobag. It's true. <laughs> he, they he, planned it. You try to attack him, and he redirects the attack, and you hear off in the distance a mirror being smashed to pieces. He takes no damage. Oh, uh, that sucks. Oh, you right. can do that to any attack, but he probably has to have a reaction. Okay, so I'm going to use my short sword now, and it's not a bludgeoning attack. I think I, I, I cheated. Somehow I lost my shifting rune. Uh, I think you got rid of it for something else. Yeah, I must have. I, c- I can't figure out the All user right, interface. So you hit with a 10. 36? Yeah. Um, he also redirects the attack Does once he really? again. Oh, that's great. And you hear a mirror shatter off in the distance. Okay. And he is. Uh, that's tired. fewer places that little coward can hide. I'm done. Bastard. Lomang is up. Going into the corner. There we go. He went right into the corner, right where he wanted you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Bludgeoning damage. Ah, a lot of damage. <laughs> you had uh, uh, everything. I got everything there. 10, 34, 44, 46. 61. I have a reaction to that. Oh, let's rough him up. Don't you break any more mirrors. I can actually. Can I punch if I'm holding a weapon? No. You have to drop. You can drop your weapon as a free action and then punch. Uh, can I drop it? Uh, can I do a, a drop as a reaction? Uh, uh, as a free action during yes. a reaction? Yes. Okay, I'll do that. But I don't know how good your attack is. Like it's a, pretty. It's, it's really good. It's really good. It's just you've been, good. You've been watching Lo Mang. Yeah, it's yeah. it's it's really good. You don't get any of your weapon pluses. Oh, that's gone. Wow! Oh come 46. on, forty-six. <laughs> that's a crit. I can't even believe it. And that's uh, that's so ridiculous. Forty-four damage. Uh, no, not forty-four. Right? Yeah, it's a crit. Ten plus eleven is twenty. Oh yeah, uh, for, yeah, forty-two. Sorry. Sorry. Ah! Wow! He punched it oh. to the <laughs> boot to the oh, head. Ah, you've learned. You're learning. Doug, awesome. You're learning the ways. Yeah. Well, I mean, look at the damage for a punch. My pluses are just as high. It's plus twenty five if I, and it's it's uh plus twenty seven. Okay, so I lose a plus two. Not bad. I thought it provokes attack of opportunity though. A punch? Yeah. If you're not trained. It oh, doesn't I'm matter. Trained. Believe me, I'm trained. It doesn't matter. <laughs> he he ran out of things. So. Uh, I pick up my short sword and I say, "That's how you do it, Lang. Anything you thing? can do, I can do also." I noticed. Can you fly? I don't know. Yeah, I can actually. I have a. Uh, still potion. have. I haven't used that potion. All right, let's. Uh, Dougie, can you search this Shatterling? See if it has any loot. Yeah, let's. I'm gonna search these. Maybe guys. it has some more card. We're looking for the, the tarot cards, still, right? Yeah, it's got to be a card in here. Okay. Well, that 
ba- that mirror is the evil mirror where Basil is, is still there. And yeah. Okay, so there's nothing in the shards where the shadowing stood? Nope. Okay. Are there any mirrors not broken? Yes. I can't tell Multiple. because everybody's up against the wall, so. Mm-hmm. There's one near Gomez. There's one near Basil. Yeah. Yeah, I want to. I want to. I feel like we should smash the one that's evil. Yeah. Well, we smash them all. All we smash. There's one by Gomez that needs to be smashed. So, so. All right. So I, I will try to not look at the mirror and use my fists of power to smash it. Uh, Dougie near, will also Gomez. use his fist of power to smash the mirror. Okay. Well, who's who? Who's really going to next to the evil mirror to smash? Well, not going. I was going to do the one near Gomez first. Oh, okay, that you smash, and it's no problem. You just smash. All right. So this one mirror is so far as appearing to be the special mirror. Okay, so I think someone who's gone over there is immured. Uh, has immured themselves. Immured. Mm. Immured. Is it immune? Inured? Yeah, immured. 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 Immured, and is thus immune. Yeah. Is it inured? I N. I think it is inured. Inured, yeah, inured. I've inured. You've inured yourself, and you should smash it with your uh, fist of power. Yeah, but I don't know if that's true. No. Oh, well, we <laughs> that's know. In the, me- we in the know. meantime, I could use my extending sword cane to attack it from a distance. I like that idea. So, um, well, we know if Lomang turns, we can quickly dispatch of him. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> that's an easy, easy fix. Yeah, well, if you want to, uh, go ahead, uh, Basil. What the heck? I'm going to start smacking the mirror with the sword cane from a distance. Give me an an attack. Because it's blunt, right? The sword cane uh, with the the thing on it. Uh, You miss. Should I do this in rounds and use my next one with with the penalty? or Whatever you want. You tried to attack. You literally missed it. That one, you bounce off the mirror. Oh, I guess we need a crit or something. Mm. All right, you need. I think we need a little. Oh, you got to start rolling better than like. Two. Yeah, we need a little more muscle. <laughs> You're rolling terrible roll. He rolled a two, so uh, you're not going to hit with a two. And then you roll a. Ugh, oh, Jesus. Oh, you roll a one. You keep trying to hit the mirror, Basil. You're doing a terrible job. You're All right. Uh, you you oh 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 what terrible! You did such terrible. All right, you're lucky. You managed to finally destroy the mirror. <laughs> it had one. It had four hit points. Oh my god! <laughs> but it has like a hardness or something. A hardness of one. Oh. But when someone's sucked into it, it's impossible to break. So you smash the mirror, and then you hear screams and see like the evil mirror universe dissipate and disappear. And then it spits out all its gold. Yes, it spits out all of its nothings. You have a pile of nothing. You know what a pile of nothing gives you? Not much. I'm gonna nothing. say nothing. <laughs> That's right. Okay. And the shadowling had nothing. And then the like, let's just bash all the other mirrors too. If I get smash all the other mirrors, yeah. and they're all smashed. All right. All right. Good. So uh, what's, what's down this little? What's this over here? It's weird over here. Uh right. those are just like a, they're just like which a which end. one of the mirrors has Grace Jones and Will Chamberlain hiding behind it? Yeah, that's a good. Uh, question. Hey man, hey man, don't uh, don't. Dougie's gonna be searching for secret doors. Don't bad math Conan. What about this door down here? Dude, was that a Conan the Destroyer reference? <laughs> it was. Yeah, it was indeed. <laughs> what? I like it. It was a Conan, Conan Destroyer, Destroyer reference. I just say that. I said don't badmouth Conan. Yep. That is the best. By referencing its awful sequel. That is the best Conan book I ever read. The worst movie, but the book is fantastic. If you ever read the was it Conan the Destroyer by Robert Robert Jordan, no less. Excellent book. Wow. Huh. Well, that's why they, I guarantee, I read this. I'm like, oh, I can see the option is a movie because the book is amazing. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah. And, and the problem is that in the book, he has sex with like four women, <laughs> including the princess, and it's all blood and guts. And the movie was PG-13. You know, Ooh, and I'm like, yeah, I remember you, that. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. They like, and they actually filmed a lot of stuff, but they made the decision to uh, for the ratings, and so they cut a lot of that movie. Yeah, out. It, 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 that it was movie. lighthearted. It was like silly. Yeah, yeah. and they had the, the thief was in it. There was a lot they added, but the scene with the mirrors that's in the book. The scene with the castle, like they're going up. You know, that's in the book. Like it was actually all in the book. I mean, they, it's a faithful adaptation of the book. It's just. Can't do a PG thirteen sanitized. You can't do a PG thirteen Conan movie. It's simple yeah, as that. You shouldn't. Yeah. You just can't. Exactly. Mm-hmm. 
you can't have comedy like the, the yeah. silly little scenes. It's yeah, they had that 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 thief guy who was like always. And, oh, and, and the whole Grace Jones comedy, oh, it that just doesn't. Terrible. It's just afraid of a rat. I mean, come on. I know. There was a lot of weirdness in that. All right. So now that we've established that. <laughs> but it did It did have enough talk, though. Enough talk. <laughs> I like uh, It had its moments. Dougie's opening this door. Okay. You open the door, and that leads out. I go out through the end door, end door. God, this that actually was the entrance you guys went yeah, through. This place just wasted our time. Like, it just was a time sink. Yeah. Everyone got to kill Omang. I don't think it was that much. Is that why the mirror no. attacked us? Because we went in through the exit? No, you just went in because it's some... Yeah, no uh, tarot cards either. No, not on that one. Not on that one. Nope. Well, it gave us an opportunity to fight Loming. That That's true. That was, that, that was, worth that was the fun for you and not for me. But, yeah. All right. I was gonna say it was more like beating on a pinata than an actual fight. It was. <laughs> it was. It was actually kind of pathetic. How you guys got how, very lucky. How how very crappy lucky. of a uh, of a fight. I mean, if I going. start critting, it's the yeah. problem. You have, <laughs> so, have to hit the crit. That's okay. not how that works. So. You have to hit the crit. So you have the desert in front of you. You have the mute hag to the west. You have the tangled briar. Bouncy Castle. And you have the Demon's Lantern to the west as well. We want the Bouncy Castle. It's not a Bouncy Castle, but it's, it's, it's you a, can go, okay. It's a castle. I'm looking inside. So I make sure I have my feather steps. You look equipped. in there, and it looks like, by the way, Basil, you should hand wave. Everyone should have one heal themselves if you want. Yep. Because mm. you all seem to be damaged. So you've been here for about an hour and a half or so at this point. This attraction is several wagon loads of sand dumped into this area it's literally a gigantic sandbox oh boy there's definitely no monster under the sand we're totally safe in here yeah it's, it's just someone who can fly maybe will be immune to uh making vibrations on the ground do we have any party members who can fight i say exactly the opposite i say <laughs> we put out the thumpers we call shy halud and we fight <laughs> wow <laughs> he's that full of red it's like it's like come get me worm yep. tell me about your home world gomez <laughs> <laughs> all right Jeez, this, is gonna, this is gonna be a big ass monster what is the fight all right this is gonna be I think but, like avoiding the, the fights is not our style. You have to. Yeah, I know, I know, but I don't want to be. I don't want to be surprised by a monster. Or, or, right. Or, that's why. That's why I say like antagonize it. <laughs> Just like, like call it on our terms. Uh, go in in there, Loming, and okay. check it out. I'm checking it out. Yeah, I don't Where mind if it? Gomez is surprised by a monster. I don't <laughs> mind if uh, Lomang is surprised by a monster. Hey, hey, uh, hey, hey, Duncan, ho- hold on a second there. Let's see. Duncan, Idaho, just wait. Don't don't worry. I, I'm uh, tracing behind. I'm I'm behind you, little man. Don't worry. Okay. Are you uh, are you uh, John Luke Picard with the little? Uh... Actually, he was Duncan too. He was Duncan Idaho, and uh, the no, he was Journey was... Halleck. Oh, he was. I uh, was he. I thought he was Duncan. Uh, he had the little pug. I never understood that scene with the pug. That never made any sense. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. It's silly. It's uh... you you trudge through the sand, and you're like. Wow, this is annoying. This is all just. This is why Anakin Skywalker hates it. Yes, gets you everywhere. Hate the sand? It gets everywhere. It's coarse. I hate it. I hate it. And then all. What's that the little thing in the northeast? Okay. Death. That's it's just, death. That's, that's literally just a, a piece of the yeah, it's a buttress <laughs> like sticking out of the wall. All right, stop moving a second. As you start looking around, walking through the sand, exactly. What you thought would happen is a creature rises up and <laughs> decides oh, to behind attack us and attack you. Awesome. Zara Moon. Zara Bahadun. Moon. Roll for combat. It's a sand level, looks like. Oh, come on. Oh, oh we killed it. Yay! Roll oh, for combat. Oh, oh, it goes first. Again. I have a picture. It's the silliest picture ever. It looks like the Sandman from Spider-Man. Oh, he it does. does. Yeah. It's big, too. It's 10 foot by 10. It's literally an Earth Elemental, and you are in its home. How dare oh, nice. you? Nice. 
Wait, you got dirt a, all over my sand. He's a he's a squatter. Like get, he's got to get out. Really? Yes. Really. By the Star Watch of Absalom, you're squatting, and you must you must vacate back to your material plane. Absolutely. Your, your plane of Earth. Okay. I, I can I can try it. You can banish him to. His I can plane. try banishing him. Really? It's not about. You know it. what he's gonna do? Serve him as eviction papers. Who wants to get the the crap kicked out of them? Not me. That would be Basil, I think. Uh, Basil's turn, yep. I'm keeping track. It's Basil's turn. Well, it would be Basil and Gomez. It's either Basil oh. and Gomez or Lomang and Mad Eye. Who wants it? I mean, they walked right over his lair. Come yeah, on. yeah, yeah, yeah. We disrespected him. Disrespected I, I, I his front porch. It. I had my turn. I had my turn with the, with the mirror kid. I, like, I, I got... I, I, and Lomang yeah, kicked the shit out of me. <laughs> okay, That's well, he, he immediately sandblasts a line of sand at Dougie and Lomang and it starts taking the paint off the wall behind Lomang. Here we go. A sand blast. 112! Uh, Wait, it's what? an automatic hit. You have to give me a reflex save or you take 11 d10 points of damage. Oh, That's right. Man. 62 points of damage. What is this automatic hit? Because it's a reflex save. It's a reflex save. Lomag 37, you fail. Oh my god. Dougie, you go. I'm 37, gonna I did it! You fail. Oh. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use a hero point. Oh yeah, Dougie's gonna use a hero point too. That's a good idea. <laughs> Oopsie. Lomag, you critically fail. Jeez, hold on. Maybe I won't. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, really I will use better. a hero point. I will use a hero point. Dougie? Critical success. No effect. You jump out of the way. Wait, wait, wait. I, I critically succeed? Yeah, because you have evasion. Yeah, so every time you make a normal success, it counts as a critical success. So you, oh. you almost, you yes, almost that's got right. sandblasted in the face. Instead, you jump out of the way. Lomang instead gets sandblasted in the face. Critically fails. Takes 62 points of slashing damage. I don't take double that? No, but you're blind. Oh, great. Blind fight. No, I don't have blind fight. No, nope, you do not. That's trash. I took blind fight. All right, 62. So that's what? That's 40. That's it is the most important thing. It is very, 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 very. It should very, be taken very. at level one to everyone who's listening to this. It is always in every, in every, in every adventure. You know, I don't know how you knew this creature was here because you know what? In sand, <laughs> he automatically gets a 50 on his stealth checks. I had no idea that he was there. No idea. I knew. Oh, believe me, I can what tell. If you, what if you blast it with water and make it mud? Really? All right, then he's going to fist that's, you that's in my the plan, face, actually. buddy. Oh, that's what I'm going to do. He's fisting Dougie right in the face. Wait a minute. He's already he's done his that attack. two actions. Oh, dang it. All right. Oh, oh my God. That was a 52 hit? Uh, that's a crit. No, see, a 52 does not hit. So I take 72 damage. Yes. You guys better bring your A-game. Um, Basil, you're up. The Vance Earth Elemental. You know, here's the thing. You can always leave. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is avoiding the monster right now. Uh, now Basil's th th up. That's a huge amount of damage. I have to get out of here. Expeditious inspection to start things out. See what I know about... See what type of uh, Pokemon this is weak to. Let's see. Do you know anything about this guy? Your nature is garbage. So you know nothing. And what type of Pokemon are you? Ooh, you get, you're lucky you have a good Arcana. Do the things you do. Okay. Well, you're in trouble. <laughs> this thing got it all, man. It has spells. It can engulf you. It can engulf everyone in one action if it wanted to. And start suffocating you. It's a tax of opportunity. It can burrow in the sand and totally disappear and be unattackable. Can it run off of sand? Yeah, it can go anywhere, but oh. he probably likes it here. It can glide through the sand with full speed, leaves no tunnel. It does the sand blast. Uh, yeah, this is a really strong earth elemental. Good luck. Fantastic. Do we know the CR level? What was the uh, devil you fought? Oh, God, really? Yes. Okay. I'm so we are not meant to fight this. Away. <laughs> yeah, we're not meant to fight this. This is this is wrong. I'm going to devise a stratagem from quite a bit of a distance. Thirty-five. I'm going to do bludgeoning if I do anything at all, because I'm going to use the extending sword cane. 
and yoink it from a distance if I Miss. even can. Okay, and that's well, actually that's two actions because the or no because move divides a stratagem attack. That's three. I was You're gonna done. say the uh, exposition inspection's free, but that's still three. Okay, Dougie's never mind. Up. All right, so Dougie is going to move one. Attack two. of opportunity. Really? Yep. Well, they, they all have them now. They all oh have boy. Them. Oh god. All right. Forty-eight. All right, so that's another seventy-two. I have forty-six left. Okay, so that's. Actually, no, I don't need to do this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, oh, section. You forgot one thing. Difficult terrain. Oh, shit. You know what? It actually doesn't say it's difficult, believe <laughs> it or not. I, 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 I have mean, a lawyer for difficult terrain. I know. I know. It actually, to, I'm you know. looking. It doesn't say it. Uh, you would think a whole thing of sand <laughs> would be. Yeah, I'm surprised it doesn't fine. say that. Yeah. It doesn't say uh, it. So, so I'm, one, I'm not two, two three, three, four, five, wow, you six. <laughs> yeah, of course I'm running away. We can't fight Marines, this. we are leaving. And one, two, three, four. Okay. Lomang, here's the thing. Blind isn't really as blind. All that means is like you have sand in your eye and you have a, if you attack, you have like a 20 or 50% miss chance, but you can still move like you're fine. Like you can just go right. anywhere and do whatever you want. So. All right. I'm going to run. I see everyone running. I'm like, all right, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out of here, Marines. You are leaving. So that's one move. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, you ran yeah, fast. fast. He's like, I'm out of like, here. All right, let's get out of here. Should I should I bother with it? Well, here, Don't bother. Fisher. No, I no, it's bother. it's it's the demon. We're not meant to fight this. Yeah, for some I think that's that not true. It makes me wonder, like what, like what's. Or we should fight him on on ground. So let's yeah, get away. Let's see if he we need us. to heal. Oh, that's an idea. Or, or it's like maximum speed. Or it's like Pokemon, and we need the right element. We need like yeah, either yeah. wind or water or something to. Mm, oh no! You grew, knew that grew. he was nothing. Uh, nothing works better against him. There's oh, no Pokemon. Okay. It's just he's just tough. I move there, then I will take out a uh, moderate healing potion in my hand. Okay. And you're no longer blind. Hey, look Pull at that. Back. Gomez is up. You could try it, banishing. My word. He can see clear. No, I'm, I'm convinced. The sand I'm convinced. is gone. I'm, I'm just going to use all of my movement to run way over here. I mean, he has plus 33. Like, he's gonna going hide. to go hit at the on corner. a I'm two. Peek around the corner. Yeah, he never misses. And he does tons of damage. He probably will crit. He crits. Yeah, I mean, he's going to crit uh, 50% of the time, probably. Yep. At least yeah, 50% through that. of the time. Dazzle, hold him back while we get away. I got him. <laughs> Zarkamon goes right to the edge of of the castle, and then he casts a spell at Basil. Oh, really? You cast I got a spell? him. Ow. Disintegrate! Oh, my God. <laughs> I got him. <laughs> I don't got him. What kind of character class have you always wanted to play? Disintegration! <laughs> give, me a, give me a fortitude save, Basil. Is that a ray? I hope it's not. It's a ray. Does he hit more than one? Uh, no, he does not. He only hits okay. one person. A fortitude of 39. Let's see. That's, that's, a, 16. Like a, hit, though, that's a 16 suppose. on die, so I can't do much better with a hero point. Well, the saving throw is actually... Oh, wait. I did this wrong. You have to roll a hit. I have to roll the hit. You're absolutely right. So you fire, make a spell attack. When the hit, you deal damage and target. On a critical... Uh, okay, if, on a critical hit... What is the when does the save do? In a critical hit to treat the save one result worse. I don't know. I guess it's just if, for the damage. All right. Well, let me do the attack. That was weird, but I'll do it. Wow. Is that what I rolled? Uh, no, it's actually plus. That is a forty. So that will hit you. So you just take. Well, I don't understand. It's like I hit you and I do a save, but it's like if you get the save, I guess you just take. Half damage? I don't know. I don't understand that. No, I don't sense. think there's a it save. It seems you hit. No, there is a save. It's like you on a hit, you deal the damage. So you take 40 points of damage, and then you attempt a basic fortitude save. Well, disintegrate is pretty grim, so it's probably... An object is hit, is destroyed, regardless. Blah, 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 blah. I have no idea why you do this. It seems like there's something missing. Like, if you look the look up the actual spell, it might have more... To it because I'm looking it up actually, it's weird when it looks like because there's some kind of save result that's one degree worse, like it doesn't explain any of that. I know, 
Well, it doesn't really matter. I'll say if you make it, whatever. So, I don't know. Even if you take 40 points of damage, it's done. And now Basil goes. and you're, I mean, it won't kill you, so I didn't roll that well. I think she can ask Mark what the hell this save is for. Okay, well, I'm going to get out of dodge. Bye! Sorry, pl sorry we played in your sandbox, sir. We'll be back when we level. All right, he, he growls at you, and then he, like, disappears. I'll be back when I need to use the bathroom. That's true. That is like a sandbox. Yeah, a big sandbox. It's literally a sandbox. <laughs> you, can, you, go, you go in there. That's why he's so angry. So many kids went in him. He's like, oh, I'm going to get you back at you. You've been listening to Roll for Combat, Agents of Edgewatch. If you have a question or comment for the show, please visit us at RollForCombat.com. You can also find us and play various games on our Discord channel at Discord.RollForCombat.com.